we take with the highlights. Race four, Mobile One Australian Production Cars and Monochrome GT4 here. Their final race at Sandown International Raceway. Beg with the best start in that McLaren 570. Made up five positions, Richard Crowell, before turn one. Yeah, really set him up to go to battle with Shane Smoller, didn't it? Those mid-mounted cars get off the line so superbly well. Storm down the inside. It's always busy behind everyone negotiating. Turn one, turn two, turn three. Evo in the middle, and then the contact there was a bit of a concertina, the Buccini BMW, Lindsay Kearns in the Colby Cowham, Mercedes AMG, and Tyler Mecklem in the Evo. Those cars were out on lap one. That brought out the Hyundai safety car. Things got back underway with Shane Smollin leading Carl Beck, but it wouldn't be the first time, not we saw the safety car. Shane for Tony Levitt after what's been a really stout weekend for the big AMG. What we don't know is how that damage happened to that car limping back into the pits and Randall and Sharon getting together down here. Uh, sorry, Lawrence and Sharon getting, to, Sharon getting together in the gravel trap down at turn number nine and sort of played out, didn't it, with the Randall car stuck in the gravel. Another safety car period. Slowed the field down and it became a couple of minutes of racing. Thinking Carl Begg would get up to give Shane Smolin a run for his money, but a mistake on the way down at turn number nine would be the end and there it was way up on the curb and from that point you are surfs up on the beach lucky not to park it down and lucky not to be collected by Jukes. Very. No luck involved for Shane Smolin. It was just good management. Stormed away out in front and got a tremendous race win.